All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. What we have for you today, a 2019 ZR1 convertible. As you know, we've had one of these before in the ZTK package. This one has the low wing, Elkhart blue, absolutely stunning color on the ZR1s, probably my favorite. Do love our ceramic matrix grays, but the Elkhart blue metallic is such a gorgeous car, matching the ZR1 emblem. You have the blue calipers, they only made 140 convertibles in 2019 with the manual transmission, this being one of them, 20 in Elkhart Blue, and now we've had two. This is one of two with the gray top, gray interior, and it really does just go really well. Uh, great looking car, especially under the sun today. You see all that metallic and all that tin coat in that Elkhart color. Window sticker on this car was 139,000, and only year the ZR1 was made in a convertible, 140 total units. So you're talking a car that's extremely rare. Um, I think in the last you know year, year and a half, I've seen one or two convertibles actively listed in a manual transmission. You just don't see them. A lot of them are being sold uh, privately. Funny that this car I actually found last July um, out west, was able to acquire it, sold it wholesale, and now kind of come full circle it's made its way back to the east coast i really did not even know that um, when i first saw it until we ran the vent it's the same vent number so to see it <coughs> kind of come full circle back to pennsylvania um, is really neat it's headed down to florida so if anybody is interested you can get in contact with us uh, but we did sell it to jld auto group so that's where it's going to be headed down in florida um, we'll, we'll be the only manual transmission convertible on the market and uh like i said i don't think i haven't seen any on the market for some time now and uh it's a, a really really rare piece last year for the front engine last year for the manual transmission and only 140 units built to have a, a convertible with 755 horsepower 715 pounds of torque um, you know, you're talking about a car with a lot of power, a lot of appearance, aesthetically looks great in, you know, the last year for the C7 model. So we start up front, again, you have that carbon fiber front splitter, carbon fiber with the blower under the hood, covering that LT5 supercharged engine. So when you're standing in front of the car, you see a lot of that carbon fiber really, really goes well with that Elkhart blue tin coat. Under the hood, you have the LT5 supercharged engine giving you 755 horsepower, 715 pounds of torque, which is the king of the Corvette when it comes to horsepower, when it comes to motor. You cannot even get an LT5 engine anymore. They've discontinued production on those cars. So even some of these cars that were being made in pro touring wise, you are no longer able to get an LT5 in any of these cars anymore. They're just not being produced. You'll see the Pilot Super Sport tires with the carbon flash wheels and your blue caliper. So our last one had the chrome wheels, the carbon flash wheels on these. Uh, this particular car here, this model, you know, looks really good. I did like the chrome on our, our last car with the ZTK, but honestly, you can't go wrong um, with the carbon flash or the chrome when you have the Elkhart blue. It just really brings everything together. It's, it's just such a great looking color. As you move towards the back, you'll see the carbon fiber ground effects, your carbon fiber vent right here um, to kind of cool your brakes. Those are the Brimbo brakes, ceramic Brimbo brakes. As we move to the interior, you have your standard Napa leather seats in that dove gray. Dove gray, probably a color that, you know, a lot of people would think, oh, I don't know if I would get it. But again, when you have the Elkhart to match with the dove gray, it really does go well together. You have a lot of black kind of two-tone interior here with your doors on the console <coughs> and on the dash to where everything really does. I mean, when you see this car in person, everything just flows and matches really well together. The 3ZR package is included. So you will have the carbon fiber steering wheel. You will have the carbon fiber around the dash and console. Um, some of the other features are the power lumbar seats, 
the heat it and cooled seats. Also uh, the heat it mirrors, front camera, and a long list of other things. That package is $10,000. So when you're looking at the window sticker of 139,000 MSRP, a good chunk of the options is coming from that 3ZR package. Really, really nice on the, the convertible is those carbon fiber inserts right behind your seats. We have that on our ceramic and also on the last Elkhart uh, blue car we had. Just gives it, again, a nice little appearance, nice little touch. This car has the low wing. Um, I gotta say on coupes, the low wing, you know, it's gonna really affect your price in terms of not having the ZTK package. But there's a lot of guys out there, a lot of people who do not like the ZTK on a convertible. They like the low wing. Uh, ZTK in terms of collectability, rareness, definitely you know something that's going to be a collector's item but this car with 65 6600 miles you can have it for a collection if you want to have it to drive because of the miles with the low wing you know maybe you don't want to have the flash of the ztk package this is the perfect car uh, for you it's subtle you know you're not going to be driving around with that uh, big ztk package and, and the high wing in the back this one's low lift it up a little bit and again it just flows so nicely everything about the car um, has a ton of eyeballs you got your exhaust in the back with the four pipes same exhaust system as the coupes so you will have your sport your touring your track so you don't lose anything and that's what's really cool about the zr1 if you go from a coupe to a convertible you're not <laughs> losing any horsepower any power uh, you know you still maintain everything that you would have in the coupe and you know there's a lot of people out there who like the convertibles you know i had several uh people inquire on our convertibles from our past videos and they're just super hard to find um, a lot of the people who have them are in collections they knew to start that it was going to be you know a one year only car and the zr1 was never made in a convertible before especially now in a manual and when you look at the final production numbers you only have 140 manuals in a convertible you know depending on the color this one elkhart blue um, only 20 units were made so it's one of the more you know scarce colors in terms of a zr1 convertible in a manual All right, everybody, so that's a wrap on our 2019 ZR1 convertible with the manual transmission. Anybody's out there looking for a ZR1, either to buy or sell, please reach out, send us an email, uh, visit our website, our phone number's up there as well, and give us a call. We're always looking for inventory. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and be on the lookout for future videos.